Today we'll be making some classic melodic dubstep like trance step as they once called it, as I called it back in the day. Because personally, I am kind of bored of the melodic bass meta. The whole like Elenium said the sky, they all kind of do the same thing. Ugh, it's kind of boring. So I think it'd be interesting if we go back, see what made that genre so special and how we can bring it to the modern times. We'll start with an ARP. Let's pick our key. Now let's go A major, just to like, just to be different, you know? The thing is, I should not have stayed up late last night playing Sekiro. Okay, now let's make the sound. Yes! That's the better pattern. All right, I might not get as excited about this song at first until it like starts really coming together, but give it some time. Trust in the process and we will make it there. Okay, okay. I think we change the chord here and then down. Down, down in an earlier round. Sugar, we're going down, swinging. Yes. Can't be dubstep without bass. Okay, I'm kind of getting happy with this. Oh wait, if we arp this bass. This kick always. Double chunk chocolate cookie. You guys want to see a neat trick? Ready for some uh, producer hacks? Okay, check this out. When you do an impact, do an EQ here, then automate the gain, and then make it go down. So you get that initial impact, but then it scoops out the mids a little so that it doesn't uh, get too bassy. Wow. What a neat trick. Yeah, yeah, I think we'll do a fake out. We'll just do that. We're music producers. All we do is scroll through snares. If you ever wonder what producers do. All right, let's do that. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. We're getting a little bit ahead of ourselves here. And uh, judging by what I heard, it's going to be a great drop. Nay, a great song. And you might have one too, so give that great song the release it deserves. That's right. With this video sponsored DistroKid, it makes it easy to upload to streaming services like Apple Music, Tidal, and Spotify. But whoa, that's a lot of different streaming services. And with more and more people saying they're going to switch from one service to another, how on earth 
earth are you supposed to keep up where to promote your upload? That's a lot of links to manage! But not with Hyperfollow. Included with your DistroKid subscription, it's one page that has all the links to all the different places your song is uploaded. So as soon as you upload your music, you can start promoting your song through pre-saves with that same link. Then once it's live, it'll automatically change to the all-in-one page for everybody to easily find your song. And since you're watching this video, you can also get an additional 7% off your first year. Just use my VIP link down below. Thank you to DistroKid for sponsoring this video. Now let me show you how I made the drop. Where are my cords? Where are my super saws? All right. <laughs> he did it. He made future melodic uh, why am I making this genre? Yeah, we need a lead. Like, it sounds super lame right now because all you're hearing are the super saws. And, like, that's what 90% of bad future bass producers do. They just let the super saws ride. But when you do stuff like this... Yeah. Plus this. Plus some wombo combo. And then, like, downsample it. Yep, hang on, hang on. Wait, that's kind of fire. Hang on, hang on, hang on. How, how do we do this? How do we do this? A few moments later. All right, I'm calling it here. Well, that was a little trip down memory lane. I hope you enjoyed it. If this is your first time hearing this style of melodic dubstep, let me know what you think down in the comments. Link to the full song is down in the description, and you can also grab the project file and see the fully unedited version of this video on Patreon. Shout out to all the patrons. Your support allows me to keep making videos like this, so thank you. Subscribe if you haven't already so you don't miss the next Next video and follow me on twitch if you want to catch the next one live i'll see you guys next time now go make some bangers